YouTube, it's Alicia here, and I am here to do a makeup tutorial. I have now decided to do a He Man Masters of the Universe makeup tutorial. Now, this is based off of a female character. So, before I get started, I am using foundation wise, um, I'm using a sampler um foundation and it is the morphe filter self focus foundation medium to full coverage and this is a long wearing oil free natural finish foundation hydrate skin blur out um blemishes for a ultimate soft look and things so yeah this is everything and the color i end up using is filter rich 26 i actually am liking it and to before i put the foundation down i end up using the wedding wow focus primer and matte so yeah so while i'm looking hold on we are going to go on and I'm going to set my under eye and we're going to set it in black radiance. And y'all know how this works. Y'all know how this works when I do videos like this. I'm going to give you, um, I'm going to give you the, um, excuse me, I'm getting tongue-tied this week, this afternoon, tonight. Um, I'm going to give you some insight on the, uh, based off of the original He-Man series. And that's since we were talking about He-Man, I know everybody know um, it's supposed to be two He-Man shows supposed to be coming to Netflix. And I don't know the actual dates, but all I know we are getting a, a, a show. Y'all know I have done a video on it. So, yeah. So, I'm going to take my Mana, Man, Man, Malani, there we go, zero nude. And I'm going to put that in, the, like I said, the character. I'm doing today is a female character who is associated with He Man, and her name is Nami. Nami, N U M I, and her name is Nami. And Nami is a pretty good, interesting character. Now, Nami, Nami is the ruler of Atlantis in the He Man um, saga in the He-Man um, um, original series and thing um, and stuff and so we're going to be using the um, Canopy uh, Splashy Candy this is the color and we're going to be using um, one of these pinks up in here we're going to be using the light blue and we're going to be using the light green so those are the um one of the colors so yes so so let's get further ado let's get started and we're going to go in with the color green because her skin is a uh, light green and like I said, her name is Nami, and I will um write down the actual episode she appears in because her is this is very interesting. This is how um we are introduced to the Atlantans and stuff, and so it has a lot to do with Merman. Merman um has captured um Princess Nami and thing in the series and in here um. Um, Princess Nami is, like I said, she is captured by Merman. And due of her being captured by Merman, um, she 
her people. She's people. She possesses the uh, oh lord, it's whirl of pearl. I think that's how you pronounce it. And with the whirl of pearl, um, Nami as her as the ruler. Nami um, possesses the power. Let me just say, possesses the power, y'all, to do thing so let me get this good and blended I want it good and blended real good all right so the next thing we're going to do we're going to take this particular brush and we're going to take this light blue right here and we're also going to put that this is the lightest blue there i'm going to have And what we're going to do, we're going to finish it up and blend it. And it's turning out already, turning out real pretty. And like I said, Princess Nami. is the ruler of Atlantis in this um, he -Man, um movie franchise. And with this, um, she, um, of her being the queen, um, she, um, possesses. And I will get, let you know at the end what the, what these colors represent based off of the series. So, yeah. And then, so the next thing we're going to do, we're going to actually, let me find it, we're going to lay down the pink, and I, the pink, uh oh, excuse me, I think the pink we're going to use is going to be this pink right here, this is the pink we're going to use, and we're just going to take it, and we're just going to It looks real good. So, like I said, um, in the He Man franchise, um, she, um, like I said, was captured by Merman, and due of her being captured by Merman, she end up helping um the let's just say her people better known as the aqualic oh, aqualicans i'm proud of the pronunciation so if you think of the name atlantis and you think of the name of atlantis people um aqualicans half mer half man half mer so that's the term let me just put it that way that's the term and with that um, her people don't trust humans. And this was the first time and her people has heard of human and everything. He has to go through there and but she meet they meet Shalindor. Shalindor knew something to um to block the pearls, possess his powers to go, go over him. So he's sort of kind of like a wizard, but you know, it's totally different. So as it goes, he um he goes, so he man a man of honors and battle cat goes next and he and tells battle cat to stay with Shalindor. They swim in and then she said, What about the monster? He might have to fight this monster, gets her out, and no no to help Nami would get bring get back her 
her position as queen. And she takes the pearl, she said, tells her people, don't follow Merman it no more. And then um, it's a pretty good, um, so what I'm using to actually set it a little um, and stuff is I'm going to be using the, um, this is, at the moment, this is one of my favorite in blood, um, setting powders, and it is the Revlon Color Stay and 410 in Cappuccino. That's my actual um, color I wear in, in, in thing. So, yeah. So, with that, that's one of the things she does. It is turning out pretty well. I like it. And um, yeah, and that's her. Um, I'm not. I don't. I'm not a big on contour and stuff. So yeah. And so we're gonna. Okay. So we have that done. So the next thing we're going to do, we're going to go on and do our highlight. So Nami, you can, I'm, I'm going to add a highlight to her. So the highlight, I'm thinking, Mer, I'm thinking I'm going to add this color right here out of this particular um, Sun Dippity Palette. And I think it's called Terramin, Terramin, but this color right here, we're going to add that. And we're going to so we have that on and I'm going to blend that out a little bit. Here it is. This is the brush I use to blend out before I I'm gonna go back. Let me put that, get that again. And I'm gonna go to my tips of my hairline and I'm just gonna dab that in and I'm just gonna put that highlight right up here a little. Just add that. And this is where I can do anything to. So. But yeah, for um, you won't be able to see it when I do finish up. But yeah, but it gives it a not. Uh, I like to use highlights in the tip top of my hairline. So with that, I'm mean, we're almost through. So the next thing we're going to take this brush and we're going to take this blush right here and thing but yeah that's how um and that's when um etheria Aternia, excuse me Aternia end up having a good relationship this is after the fact that's the only episode and that's when they start having a good relationship um with the um with the aquaticans and stuff like that. I know I'm pronouncing it um pronouncing it funny, but if you go and you look at the episode, you'll get it. Alright, we're gonna do another blend out right here. And before I go, we're going to take this brush again and take the same color. And we're just coming in with that. And we're going to take this brush and we're just There, I mean, 
I'm doing a lip color. Her lip color is this very vibrant um, pink. So while I'm finishing up, before I finish up, let me um, give you a, a little finish up before I think. go to my lips and go to my brows. And I'll be using my favorite brow gel. And we're going to come in with this nudie color in right here. So what we're going to do, we're going to take this brush, we're going to dab it in. And we're just going to very lightly put that in. As we do that, we're going to do a good blend out right here. We're just going to blend out, blend that out and stuff. And so while I am doing my brows, I am going to tell you about the why I pick this the green, the blue, and that particular pink. The green represents her skin because she's mostly green. In the series, when you do meet her out oh, and on her typical episode, when you meet her, she's mostly green. Her um, skin is very, is very green and stuff like that. So yeah. So yeah. So the next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go in with the Maybelline. Tattoo Studio Brow Gel. I only use brow gel. And this is my favorite. So while we're waiting, letting that sit a little bit, we're going to go on to the lips. And for the lips, I'm going to do, she has this sort of like pinky color, so I'm going to use this color by Revlon called Wow Cherry. At one point they never had this one up there. This is, it's, this is the color I'm using, but I'm going to use a probably, I'm going to use a tapping motion for it. And you're going to get a lot of tap motion. Okay, I like how it turned out. But we're going to blend in. Where is that color? We're going to blend in mink in it. Same situation. And there you go, that is the lips. So now we're just gonna go finish off the brows. mascara right here. It's one of my favorite mascaras. I've been using it for years. And I'm going to show you a trick I do for my brows as well. So I'm going to take one of my clean, my clean spoolie, and I do this number. I 
there we go and just to make sure I'm getting a good blend out and there you go that is the wake up look um, I love it um, I think just doing this character I feel life for this makeup look and I will say this I will leave you a little bit more info. Um, I'm gonna leave you the episode name at the below. But like, let me hear what you think. What do you think about my He Man Masters of the Universe makeup tutorial on Princess Nami? Until then, y'all, I'm Alicia. Don't forget to thumbs up this video, comment below, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.